for North of 35 Latitudes and Attitudes. Today we are in Croatia. Now can anybody say the name right? Plitris, Plitvis, Plitvis National Park. <laughs> Plitvis National Park. Yeah. <laughs> and I met Amy and Clay on a bus. I heard a Canadian accent. Shocking. It's a twang. A twang, as somebody, <laughs> a lady who was nice and said. And we just got talking some more, and so I thought there'd be an awesome couple to interview. Aww. Aww. Thanks. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, first, tell me the story of how you've arrived to Croatia. Well, we're here for the David Gilmore concert in Pula, which is going to be next Saturday. And uh, we just, I randomly picked up the tickets to the show because I love his work. And uh, that was back in, I think, March we bought those. And so, so we're. So, well, like, like more than, like, quite six months yeah, ago? Yeah, earlier this year. Okay. And then uh, I was kind of going back and forth whether or not to go on the trip or just sell the tickets. And then thought, yeah. we saw some pictures and just said, let's go for yeah, it. Yeah, we did some reading yeah. and yeah. just. And he is one of the band members, the original band members He's, of Pink Floyd. That's right, yes. the singer and guitarist from Pink Floyd. I know. They're going that's to see great. Pink Floyd in Croatia. And not just in Croatia, you guys get to see him in like a giant, beautiful amphitheater, right? Yes. Yes, that's right, in the Pula Arena. Yes. Yeah, on the coast. So. On the coast. Yeah. Yeah. So. A once in a lifetime. Yeah, like you show. said, you didn't really know if you wanted to come to Croatia. And then yeah. yesterday, you didn't know if you wanted to come here. And tell That's me right. about that. Uh, we were just looking at things to do from one of those brochures you pick up at the tourist information. And yeah, Clay was like, we need to go to this national park. And Look beautiful. Yeah, so we it booked is. our bus ticket and... <laughs> Yeah, we are. and so we met on the bus, and that's how we all met, and yeah. we just got this, we've just been hanging out all day together yeah. at this amazing park, which I think all of us agree, need more team. time. Yeah. Yes. Two days. If only. Guaranteed, if you're coming to this park, spend two oh, days yeah. here. Like, we only saw one part of it, which was like the three to four hour walk. Should have stayed longer. Yeah, yeah. for sure. Shoulda, coulda, woulda. Don't, can't do anything about it. But Michelle shared her sandwiches with us, and that was really <laughs> Yeah, important. that was a lifesaver. <laughs> it gave us the extra energy we needed to get through the whole trip. <laughs> yeah, so we could do that extra yeah. extra half an hour that we decided to tag on. Yeah. It's crazy. So, in the normal questions I ask, so the first question is, tell me a little bit about your guys' story since turning 30. Uh, well, can you Just a back? little bit. <laughs> What's happened since, since turning 30? Well, I've been 30 for, I guess, two years. Uh, I don't know. Well. You got married when you were in your 20s. You got, would have got married in your 30s. That's right. Yeah. Yep. yeah. Just three years ago we were married. So uh, yeah. that's happened since we turned 30. And I, I guess, guess for the most part we've been dating since I turned 30. <laughs> yeah. Around that time. So uh, we've yeah. traveled around the world a few times Yeah, we've now. been on, I guess so, we've been to China, Jamaica. We got married in the Dominican. Engaged in Italy. Italy. Uh, <laughs> yeah. South, South America. America so. Year. So we've been traveling a lot and uh, just recently at home, we're from Saskatoon, Canada. We just uh, moved out into the country onto an acreage. So that's, oh, our, wow. that's yeah. a new life we're making together just the last yeah. few weeks. So, that's uh, huge. Yeah, yeah. So, I own horses, so okay. it'll be a change I'm, of lifestyle, I guess. Yeah. I'm no longer living. a city boy. So. Yeah. <laughs> How are you doing at that? Well, oh, you don't know been a couple here. weeks. <laughs> we've literally lived in, like, we've yeah. lived in that house for about five days and then we're like, oh, I guess we gotta go to Croatia. Yeah. Oh, darn. <laughs> Yeah. So tell me some of your biggest accomplishments, like obviously getting an acreage is a huge accomplishment since yeah. turning 30. What are your, some of your big other big accomplishments? I guess job wise we've both had, we both have pretty, I guess successful careers and mm -hmm. um, I worked my way up through the bank and um, yeah, I don't know, it just, I'm, I travel lots. I just do everything that I have always wanted to do. So you live in your bucket list now. Yeah, that's yeah. right. Yeah, just yeah. seeing where we want to see and uh, yeah. And enjoy being married for the first few years. Just us. Live, in the now. <laughs> live in the now. Yeah. Before yeah. family yeah. comes along. So. Have you guys been bugged about that? When are you oh, having kids? When are you having kids? Constantly. Having kids? Yes. Yeah. And yeah. but yet you're doing it your way, right? Yeah. Like you're 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 getting your traveling. You're getting your career. Yeah. Uh, you're getting like you're coming to see concerts. You're doing yeah. all that, and then. You know, when when it's right, it's gonna feel right. Exactly. Absolutely. And yeah. I, I do have an eight-year-old son. Okay. And uh, and he keeps me guessing all the time. Too, so so, <laughs> so that's there is already a yeah. child in the yes. in the circle of yeah. it right, all. There is. Right. Yeah. So uh, yeah. Yeah. No, yeah. He keeps us going too. Cool. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So what kind of attitude do you think you guys possess to do these like accomplishment things? Got to be a bit spontaneous. You got to. I don't know. Can't let yourself get held back. I mean, there's so many, it's so easy. many ways yeah. to just say, "Well, I can't do this because yeah. of yep. this," or "No, I'm too old to do that." All right. Yeah. So you got to think past those sort of, I don't know, 
obstacles because a lot of them aren't real. Yeah. Just people yeah. get that in their head that they can do this, they can't do that. And, uh, yeah. yeah. What a perfect tie-in because my next question is, how do you overcome fears and negative thinking? Ah, oh, that's a good question. <laughs> you got to balance each other out. <laughs> it's, it's true, it's true. Um, I, you I told you do, earlier yeah. I'm the worrier. Yeah, um, I know we were talking about that. <laughs> the group, so. Um, but I guess Clay's kind of carefree attitude just kind of lets me let go. And then, like, at the end of the day, I'm like, well, what an amazing experience yeah. I've had. And I'm so thankful that... Had I been my worrying self, and maybe not... you guys don't even have a bus ticket to not, get back yet. No, <laughs> no I do. No, I'm we'll not one. sure how that's <laughs> happening. We'll I'm sure one. it'll all work out. Yeah. <laughs> but you kind of tied in, like, the fear. Like, you have to say, like, is this even real? Right. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Uh, and, like, we're both spontaneous as well, but sometimes in different ways. And yeah. sometimes I can be a bit pessimistic about things as well. And right. it gets me going on that. So you just, I don't know. With, with us, we work together. To yeah. To yeah, I think when the other together. ones, maybe you can tell if they're going maybe in more negative or... I don't even know if negative is the right word, but if yeah. they're being a bit more pessimistic about it, then the other one seems to know it's my time to step up and yeah. we're going to do this. So it just seems to yeah. work well that way. <laughs> Very cool. Were you guys always that way? I think so. With each other? I think so, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. With others? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> No, but like with your like other family member stuff, do you find that you've always like been able to balance each other's out, or is it more just since you guys came together? I think we just work really well together this yeah. way. Yeah, yeah, I think so. Very it's cool. part of what brought us together. Yeah, yeah. definitely. Okay, <laughs> if you could give one piece of advice to the world, this being your world oh, right God. now, <gasps> on any topic, anything, one piece of advice, what oh, would geez. you give the world? Jeez, I don't know. For me, just just don't hold back on things that you want to do and find a way to do them. Um, I don't know, just get out there and, and have fun with it and, I don't know, enjoy your life. Yeah, that I think my advice would be rather the same. Just if you have a dream, just, it's possible. Yeah. Stop right? saying you can't do things. Yeah, no, <laughs> just, and exactly, yeah. exactly. Cause I think maybe that's your roadblock. And a lot of times the roadblocks aren't even, they're not even real, right? Yeah. There's just like, oh, you know, if you really want to do something, yeah. you can do it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. 100%. You can, 100% yeah. you can do it. It's easy it's, to say you can't. Yeah, it's, it's a lot yeah. easier to say you can. It's a lot, easy, yeah. it's a lot easier not to start. Like, I, I'm, one of my things that I've said is I would rather I would rather try and fail than regret not trying at all. Yeah. Yeah, so, totally true. Yeah. Okay, what's your future plans? Future plans? <laughs> Find a bus ticket. Never know what oh, we're doing. Probably, yeah. Yeah. We gotta get home. <laughs> Maybe bus back. Uh, yeah. No. You wanna do stuff on the acreage? Oh, there's lots to do on the acreage. Set up my barn and fences and stuff. But yeah, I mean, learn a whole new lifestyle. Yeah, the country. that'll that, be that's the big our thing. Our next big yeah. obstacle. Here, so. That yeah. sounds like a good yeah. future. And then we'll plan. take it from there. Yeah. And who knows where we'll end up next? Yeah. Year, so. so should we do like the old traditional Canada? <laughs> and to end it. What do you think? We could. We could. Sure, sure. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not really, I don't find that I say it. Do you guys I, say I it? I don't find that I do. <laughs> okay, I let's just say goodbye, Canada. Yeah.